Welcome to another success video. Everybody, you know me, I'm Matt. Didn't have a video planned for today, but I just saw something and I'm way late to the party that I want to talk about. What a beautiful day to be in Alberta, above zero and working on, look at all the toys everywhere again. As usual, toys everywhere. Tomorrow is the release of the new Articat stuff. And I know I should be talking about the Skidoo stuff and also the Polaris stuff, but because of my ties with Articat, let's start by talking with them. I think a lot of you have probably seen this picture and it's, yeah, it's, I guess it's kind of a leak of the new Articats for 2019. And you guys, let me know, look, take a look at this picture first. Let me know what you guys think. Is this, uh, is this real or fake news? I'm hoping it's real because if it is, that is freaking awesome. I guess we'll find out tomorrow for sure. Um, by the time I think a lot of people watch this vlog, I think uh, Articat's official stuff is actually going to be out, so it'll make, make this uh, blog completely obsolete by then. But here's my speculations anyway. I'm hoping that what you see in this picture is true. I'm hoping that that is the rail, the new skid uh, for Articat. I'm hoping for like an Alpha Cat or something like that. I'm thinking that it is a proven design. There are companies I've seen make this aftermarket uh, as, a, as like a skid you can drop into your sled. Uh, it's gonna need a new track. It's gonna need its own special track. I don't know about the drivers I don't know about any of that, but it's gonna need its own track now It's not gonna be kind of you know, you can kind of drop in whatever picture track into your Articat or um, Summit or Polaris or whatever, right? I think the first question that comes up with this skid is Strength is this thing gonna last like if I if I go off a jump is this thing gonna break? Well, I can tell you right now that it's not gonna be like that thin little, whatever, quarter inch thick aluminum that uh, the rails currently are. It's gonna be a thicker aluminum, uh, if it's even made out of aluminum. I assume it's gonna be made out of aluminum. It's gonna be something a little better than that. I think that the durability of this thing is, I, th I think you're under, I think you're undercrediting for this durability. Like as far as the trail and dynamics of this skid, it's gonna be completely different because this is like essentially the skid of a like a snowhawk or something like that that we're dropping into an m8 so what is this going to be like an alpha cat it's i don't know about their if they're doing the uh the trail models or not i know the mountain models are going to come like I, I assume all the the leaks and everything uh all the news that i'm able to give is actually news and not just like speculation or somebody didn't just build a skid and like powder coat their tunnel and bumper and make it look like it's supposed to fit in there i'm assuming that this is going to be um the release i'm hoping so anyway i really like that skid i i i, I want a 2019 i might have to buy one if that's the skid i love that design 13 pounds weight savings on that allegedly which is you know that that's a lot to be saving in a skid for sure we're also from what i've heard through the grapevine is that they are dropping the 153s the 162s and switching to a 154 um one 63 or whatever whatever the pitch adds up to be be like skidoo and uh polaris that's again i don't know about that for sure but i really like that three pitch track so i'm hoping that isn't actually the case i just want to know what you guys think of this thing i think it's freaking awesome so i hope that is the production model sled because i absolutely love that idea let me know what you guys thinking down in the comments i'll try to do an upload tomorrow on actually like what the what the true release is of these sleds um, I don't get excited very often. I was excited last year for the 2018 release because I knew it was going to be completely different. But now, oh man, this skid is like, it's huge. I'm super excited for it. It's going to be completely different dynamic. It's going to be like kind of, maybe like a T-motion kind of feeling, but I don't really know. I'm usually the first guys, uh, me and my team here at Sixes are the first guys on these things for the new release this year. We're not going to be on them this year and it's something beyond my control it's beyond dealer control it's because articat isn't able to get all these units out um to everybody to demo them like they did last year sorry no 2019 demo ride no 2019 early release review video like every other year anywho obviously i'm not in bc this weekend I'm not riding in the mountains this weekend you guys saw the video that i posted uh last week or last weekend or whatever of seeing that deep alberta powder so we're gonna go look for that again tomorrow i got a couple spots and i think a lot of people um have been riding out west near marble mountain which is where i showed you where that deep powder was uh because of that video i've had a lot of feedback from it 
but um, we're not going to be riding there. We're going to be riding somewhere a little different because I think I know a couple places where the snow is just as deep, if not deeper. All I got for this video, like I said, I didn't really plan on doing a video today. I just saw this stuff. Like, I, I was late to see it. I'm like, I'm way late to the party seeing this rail. But the release is tomorrow, so uh, we'll know a little bit more. Like I said, I didn't have a video planned for today, but I did want to talk about it. Maybe I'll do an update on your skidoos and also your Polarises. I'm a mountain sled guy. Well, as always, I'm super excited to get out. Always excited to go ride. I've never had a bad day, even when stuff's getting broken or it's cloudy and I can't see two feet in front of me and I'm driving off cliffs and all that stuff. Sure would like to take the bike out, but that's on for another oh, month at least. Thanks everybody for watching. You know, if you like this video, subscribe to the channel, hit that like button down below. And if you are subscribed, then you can keep up with our current giveaways and all that other nonsense that we're doing. And that's about all I have today. Uh, excited for the release tomorrow. Excited to go bang around in Alberta and go wreck stuff in the usually pretty not good Alberta snow. Um, if you're riding this weekend, stay safe out there and we'll see everybody in the next video. Oh, yeah.